Phantom 3 Tutorials, updating the firmware. Download the latest firmware update for the corresponding Phantom. Visit the official DJI website, dji.com, and go to the Phantom 3 product page. Click the download page and download the latest firmware update package. Ensure there is at least 100 megabytes of free space on the micro SD card. Extract the downloaded files. You can also refer to the included PDF file for step-by-step -step directions on updating the firmware. Copy the file with the extension bin into the root directory of the SD card. Updating the flight controller. Please remove the propellers before updating the firmware. Insert the micro SD card into the micro SD card slot on the Phantom's camera. Do not power off the aircraft during the update. Power on the aircraft. The update will begin automatically. It will take a maximum of 25 minutes to complete the update. The gimbal will emit a beeping sound when it is ready to update. Please wait until the sound changes. The gimbal will emit a fast beeping sound when the update is in progress. Please wait until the sound changes. Disregard the LED indicator or any sounds from other modules, as they do not reflect the status of progress of the firmware update. The gimbal will emit a slow beeping sound when the update is complete. When the update is complete, you must restart the aircraft manually. If the gimbal emits a long beeping sound, this means the update has failed. Restart the aircraft and the automatic firmware repair process will begin. The process is complete when the gimbal stops emitting the long beeping sound. You can also remove the micro SD card to check the final status of the update. Open the text file that is automatically generated after the update. Result success means the update was successful. Updating the remote controller. Ensure that the remote controller's battery has at least 50% remaining power. Do not power off the remote controller during the update. The remote controller's firmware is included in the update package downloaded from the official DJI website. Insert the micro SD card into a card reader and plug the reader into the remote controller's USB port. Power on the remote controller and wait 20 seconds until the update begins. The remote controller will begin updating automatically. A beeping sound and the remote controller status LED will indicate the progress and status of the update. The update is in progress when the status LED is blue and the remote controller emits a fast beeping sound. The update is complete when the status LED turns green and the remote controller emits a slow beeping sound. Restart the remote controller. If the status LED is red and no sound is heard, the update has failed. Restart the remote controller and the automatic firmware repair process will begin. Wait 5 minutes and then restart the remote controller again. The process is complete if no sound is heard. The beeping sound may stop and start during the update. Do not power off the remote controller. It will take a maximum of 10 minutes to complete the update. You can also remove the micro SD card to check the final status of the update. Open the text file that is automatically generated after the update. Result success means the update was successful. Updating the remote controller without a thumb drive or micro SD card reader. Insert the micro SD card into the camera. Plug one end of the USB cable into the remote controller's USB port. Plug the other end into the micro USB port of the gimbal. Power on the remote controller. Power on the aircraft. Wait approximately 20 seconds. The remote controller will begin updating automatically. Note, do not turn off the remote controller during the update. When the update is complete, restart the remote controller. Turn off the aircraft. Turn off the remote controller. Remove the USB cable. Restart the remote controller and the aircraft.
Open the DJI Pilot app to check if the firmware has been updated. Thanks for watching.